Well, the legislature was on a two-week working vacation, uh, but while we were off, uh, university boards of trustees were making very difficult decisions that have a real financial impact on students, on access to higher education, and on parents that are trying to help send their children to college. Uh, Michigan State University's board of trustees struggled because they didn't know how much funding the legislature was going to be providing. Uh, they settled on a 9.6% increase. That equates to $978 more, uh, let's call it what it is, it's, it's a tax increase uh, for those incoming freshmen and their parents. Um, uh, other universities, uh, I'll give you some numbers, uh, Grand Valley State University increased their students' tuition by 9.9 percent, Eastern Michigan University 9.5 percent, Lake Superior State University 9.3 percent, Oakland University 13.9 percent, uh, and Central Michigan University trying to keep a guarantee over four years for students, 21% increase uh, over four years for their incoming freshmen. I called upon the legislature over a month ago, in fact it was June 7th, that July 1 should be our real hard and fast deadline to balance our budget. Let's be clear, universities, school districts, most municipalities have July 1 as a fiscal year and they expect the legislature to do its job. Mike Bull is the executive director of the President's Council of State Colleges and Universities said it right. The state has balanced its books or is balancing its books on the backs of students and their parents in the form of higher tuition. You know, look, we have delayed payments to those universities. I mean, we use that as one gimmick to balance the 2007 budget year, so we've already delayed payments. Uh, into next year for those universities and they don't know how much money is going to be coming in the first place. There's time, but uh, you know, to be responsible uh, we should have passed our budget you know, three weeks ago. Mm -hmm. uh, but that being said, we need to act quickly. Uh, other universities are, are hedging their bets. They're waiting. They're holding their breath, waiting for the, uh, the, the, the legislature to do the right thing. I mean, let's be clear, uh, in February uh, Governor Granholm presented a balanced budget. Uh, it provided a 2.5% increase to universities and community colleges in this case. Similar increase for uh, public school districts and municipalities for, for police and fire services. And the legislature just has not acted. We have got to step up to the plate. We should not uh, uh, play a waiting game. We should not uh, uh, you know, continue to balance uh, the state's budget on the back of these uh, students, many of whom literally are making a decision about whether they can afford to go to college or not.